Disney has filed for a patent on a, quote, sword device with retractable internally illuminated blade, and this move could signal the company's intention to develop the most realistic officially licensed lightsaber to date. So that's very exciting news. Now, Disney hasn't yet announced a release date for new lightsaber products that would incorporate this technology, this retractable blade technology. It seems pretty likely that we'll start seeing some of these retractable blade lightsabers sometime in 2019 though, especially since 2019 is a big year for Star Wars, you guys. We have a lot of major things going on. The Mandalorian live-action Star Wars TV show is coming out in 2019. The Star Wars Episode Nine movie will be released in December. And then a little before that, the Star Wars Galaxy's Edge Disney theme park expansion will open. So these are some very major dates for Star Wars fans. It seems likely that the new retractable lightsabers would coincide with, well, at least one of those dates, but probably the kind of Disney park opening thing, the Galaxy's Edge opening. That seems pretty likely. Okay, so a little bit more about this technology, you guys. So the, the patent filing describes the retractable blade design as including, quote, two long plastic semi-cylinders, and these two blade body members are rolled perpendicular to their length, which creates compact cylinders of material of small volume that can be provided on a pair of spools in the hilt. And in addition to that, a, light, a flexible lighting strip um, would be used to illuminate the blade. So this is something we haven't seen before. This is different. I mean, if you think of retractable blades, you might think of kind of cheap Star Wars toys with the telescoping blade. Let's see, I think I have one nearby. So it's very different from this existing technology, if you can call it that. Um, a lot more advanced than that, a little more like, uh, I guess, a tape measure coming out of a lightsaber hilt, but at any rate, we'll have to see it when it comes out, but this is very exciting. Now, none of the other official lightsabers on the market or custom lightsabers on the market use retractable blades, so this is a very big deal, very disruptive to the market, or you know, it will be once the product is actually manufactured. Uh, presumably, it will be manufactured next year. Now, I did previously talk about, you know, in an earlier video and post on sabersourcing.com, there's a YouTuber called Saber Scroll, and he released some videos of his own retractable lightsaber. It's a different style. I'll, I'll link to um, some of that below. You can feel free to check that out. But this is a new and exciting lightsaber technology, and it's kind of unclear exactly how it will affect the entire market, especially the custom labor, uh, saber community, rather. But it's cool. <laughs> so we'll have to see what happens with that, presumably in 2019. What do you think about this new technology? How do you think it compares to some of the other big technologies in, well, at least the custom saber community at the moment? I mean, we have the Profi board that was released in 2018. We have NeoPixel blade technology kind of, you know, taking the custom saber community by storm as well. So we've got lots of exciting things. And then now with officially licensed lights, Sabers, we have this new retractable blade technology that we will see pretty soon, probably. But feel free to comment below. I'd love to hear what you guys think about this.